bubble, and because he was within 200 centimeters of the Aphilios, managed to bring him down. Yeah. With one more ability. That's all she needed. That's that's really did the most damage on her team. But Azir, I think with just that play, a Goblin win. <laughs> Showmaker is the pog right from the get go. Shouldn't be much of a question. As that fight could have just ended there if Showmaker wasn't able to pull that off, or if the dragon didn't get smited down by Canyon, another big play from the Jamon Gaming jungler. As now Azir is really beginning to pop off. He has kept the lost chapter the whole time. He never built it into anything. Went straight void step after seeing a bunch of magic resist. So, well, I guess he does have the Morellos as well. So. He's just got all the penetration here, and now he's looking to build into what looks like the death cap. So, 3-0-1, could Showmaker carry the game himself? It's a good question. Trying to run down Spirit in the jungle, in the river rather, Ragnarok gonna come down, trying to burst him down, Spirit oh, flashing away. Die. There's no way, Flight can't help him here. The sleep is gonna come in, as just one more would do it, but he lives. But he's so low and he doesn't have flash. As now they want to turn on to the Baron, but down in the bottom lane, the push is coming in. Can they actually oh. steal this away? I think Keen can end the game if he's going to stop the back. Okay, the Baron is in, and now they just got to stop the backs. They're looking to push here. Showmaker just wants the back. He's got Baron, but now he decides to stay. Somebody has to get oh. back there and stop it. They get vision on him, they're stopping the backs for now. Everyone trying to out. recall, can Spirit do it? Oh, no, he stops it! He's not gonna get the recall! He roosted Showmaker. And he is gonna get out, but is there enough time to stop it? He's the only one, and now I think Soraka got back. And yes, it will be enough with the so, Baron up minions. It's very strange, actually. Keen could have gotten that last oh, turn, but still going. they're gonna double kill Aphilios. And can it's only... Soraka and Showmaker. But right Azir now. is still alive. And yeah. I think Azir with Baron should be enough to push them back, but let's see. No, not, not against one Nexus turret. This is going to be it. No, they got Olaf. Oh, they, oh, Olaf did actually spawn. Yeah, and Azir is scaring them off, and so they say, okay, inhibitor and back. I it's going to be the call. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely yeah, right. I thought Olaf's death time was actually a lot longer. I did not look at it. But, very interesting, Keen didn't elect to take some damage using his W in order to just raise that last Nexus turret. And so, we'll see what ends up happening here as Baron goes down, everyone's stopping the backs. Olaf ends up going down extremely early, Senna Ultimate coming out, and it, it is a a full court press to try to stop this recall here and honestly spirit he roosts the azir but then doesn't stop him and if he did i they would end I think the game because would end. yeah they absolutely spirit would die to the azir but then mystic fly and jelly would be able to indefinitely stop the recalls and keen would have just been able to end the game and it doesn't end there guys <laughs> We have the Ocean Soul points coming up here for Afrika. And Damwon will start it off. They got a couple of players with Baron still. Five oh. on five trying to get in there, and it goes to the trundle! They get the Ocean Soul, but can they stay alive? It looks like, yes, they can. The Cosmic Radiance That's a in. very early wish. And the wish comes in, too. And oh. you can see Beryl is going to survive. Showmaker oh. trying to do it alone. Keep looking for the angle from the bottom. But oh. he is, okay, they're looking now. Spirit on the back Hold side. On. Getting the big time slow on the so many members. Keen looking for it here. He's going to have to use Amper's device to just get away as Dawan are on the escape, but he's over the wall trying to use the soldiers, but he cannot do enough damage, and now they're just trying to oh. back. Keen over the wall. He's going to have to stop watch. Brock Lesnar. Yeah, I'm going in there. Yeah. Now I think they've got them with the suplex. Dunk them down, but we do have Nuclear still alive! Oh, nuclear oh, and triple kill as the Quadra kill comes in for his ear, but they're pushing in the base! They're trying to get the kill on the Spirit and then back, but I'm not sure if they're going to have enough time to do it here as the minions are getting to work! 
And we have Nuclear catch back. Okay, they're finally able to stop the Nexus from going down. And the game will not end here at 36 minutes. Showmaker is really putting on a last stand here. Nuclear manages to salvage everything. Let's take a look at this one more time. The Ocean Drake goes over to Trundle. This waltz is in. And you can see Keenan, he's going to end up going in, looking for an angle to try to get in. And the wish was really early. It came out for one person only. Beryl ends up losing all of his life. Keenan still looking for a suplex there. Showmaker doing his best to try to give teammates a window to get home because Azir can end up departing much easier. He gets onto him, but Emperor's Divide comes out. No suplex able to be channeled. Duggery goes over the wall. And watch Beryl here. <laughs> ends up going down. Keen going over. And as soon as he comes out of stasis, Brock Lesnar with the F5 right into Dogwan. But Soraka, Soraka and Showmaker. Soraka. <laughs> it's all Soraka. It really is. It's all Soraka. And she just focus heals his ear because Nuclear's got the Severum, so it's just, he just focus W over and over on his ear and he stays alive. <laughs> Soraka's the real hyper carry. Let's give this pog over to Soraka, the champion. Yeah. Didn't even need Wish. The, the, re the reality of the situation is, is that all the flair looks like Showmaker, but it's really Soraka carrying these fights. It is undoubtedly her invalidating so much of what Afrika's trying to do. And Soraka is staring Ocean Soul in the face saying, yeah. I'm better than you. <laughs> well, I mean, there was, no, there was no question there. Oh, man. Take a look at the total damage dealt fly on top by a pretty large margin. I believe at nuclear. Can we get a damage a healed? Yeah, <laughs> that's the real chart we need. He is in kind of an awkward spot here. This is going to be a three on one. We have a Felios coming down too. Baron is coming up right now. Three yeah. seconds. This is very scary. That's Canyon. Canyon's in the bottom side. Uh, <laughs> this is going to be. They're going to get Baron away. The Ocean Soul plus Baron bolster team composition. <laughs> Just push down one of the side lanes without the turrets and try to end. This is definitely interesting, Aldo. That's all I gotta say about it, all right? That's the real question. Do they oh. try to go for the end? Total team, okay, 29,000. <laughs> well, it's pretty good. All right. I <laughs> Pretty good. Remember that number that uh, Zoe did? 34,000 earlier on? Yeah. Yeah, Soraka's just behind her. <laughs> <laughs> just like all the damage from Abrika. It's just immediately healed up. Yeah, it's, it's not bad. I think this champion is kind of good. Might consider picking her up. For the this time. Is a very scary situation. And this is another thing that I, I want to point out is look at the difference in terms of the supports in terms in regards to items. You have Mikhail's Crucible as well as Shirelia's on Tarek, but you look over at Senna and her items are just so much more impactful in, in terms of her ability to influence things, not even considering her souls. So the Tarek, while he is a fantastic champion, it really does feel like Domwon is sort of playing a four versus five right now. And that was part of the appeal behind the Senna. Feels like she's really strong right now. I think Korea's beginning to see that, and she's getting banned and picked a lot more here in week four compared to the previous weeks. And we're beginning to see exactly why. How many souls does she have? That'll be a good question to get answered if we can. You can see just how much slow that Killer has right now. Yeah. It's actually really good than Zoe. You wouldn't expect it. But, oh, he just disappears! And that's that's a fight before right away. And this oh, is boy. really looking like the Hobbit right now, that one tower. <laughs> oh, man. I am not sure 
it, how how many years Don Juan can try to hold on here? It's the one tower, and they have a one three one going, and they're just gonna push in now. There's no cosmic radiance. There's no real way to group up and try to team fight this. They have to rely all on the Soraka. It's not the first time, and they do have an Azir. We have seen that before as well. Nice. Oh. Okay, he's gonna cleanse that one. Being poked down by the Caitlyn. Here comes Team from behind. It's the healing there. The green is going to blast away when the turret goes down. They can just click the Nexus right now, but they're just going to go for the fight. It's a cosmic radiant. It's going to come down. Kane going to try to take the kill, but it does not matter.